All right, so we're out from the Mirage. I wanted to show you a couple of shots real quick, but the fire show is going off and it's the first time it's going off since it's reopened since the lockdown. So we're gonna head over there now. That's the Mirage, which is now officially back in business. The iconic resort, one of the final Las Vegas Strip properties to reopen. All right, so we just parked at the Mirage. We're about to head in. We're gonna check in. I'm gonna try the $20 trick and try to get the best possible room I can possibly get. It's the first day the Mirage has reopened since the pandemic began and the shutdown began, so excited. I want to see the pool. I want to be at the pool. I want to chill at the pool. I want to spend my whole time at the pool. <laughs> Pumpa really. Yeah. Yeah. I tried to say it slow, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see here. Thank right. you, enjoy, okay? Alright, so we got an upgrade. I had to pay 10 extra dollars. And she didn't want the 20 bucks. Oh yeah, so that's what, oh yeah, that she, weird. <laughs> she didn't accept my 20 dollars. <laughs> but... Whatever. This view of like seeing the mirage right there. Wow, this bathroom is legit. Oh my god. Yeah, it is. Really nice. Tub. Pretty nice shower too. Nice shower. I really love this. Like this is So this room is actually really great. Super unbelievably clean, great view. We have a great view of the Mirage sign as well. So that's pretty cool. We got our care package thing here. This is another MGM owned property. So this does not surprise me. Um, it says Mirage on it. We got these bad boys, some hand sanitizer and a couple masks. Um, but yeah, this place is super nice. The room is a bit small, but I mean for one or two people, it's perfect. And the bathroom is just, whew, that's an immaculate bathroom. All right, so we're about to go down to the pool. I'll do the room tour a little bit later, switch up the flow a bit. Italian so we actually are making a pit stop to grab lunch before I go to the pool. Just thought I'd clue you in on that. <laughs> Yo, there's no one here. We're searching for the habitat. Apparently there's a section here that has like dolphins and tigers and all sorts of wild animals. So we're searching for that now. And then we're gonna actually take a dip. Okay, Greta? Big fat dip. <laughs> Big fat dip. Hello, buddy. Oh my God, he's so cute. That's our largest dolphin there. That's Osborne. Oh, 680, 82 pounds. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're in the other section. We just saw some dolphins, and now we're gonna see some tigers. So right Thanks, there are the tigers. Oh, Greta, 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 Greta. Look at this guy. 
<laughs> and as you can see, we have another Maybe sleeper here. over here. <laughs> Okay, we just got back from the pool. We had a really good time checking out the habitat and hanging at the pool, except for the fact the pool water was just freezing cold. So it kind of put a damper on the experience a little bit, but anyway. Oh, and I also lost my sunglasses, which I jumped in the pool, didn't realize I had the sunglasses on, but besides that, it was really good. <laughs> and now let's do the room tour like I promised. leaving a room to go to an Italian restaurant to have food because we love Italian food obviously and <laughs> it's called Osteria Costa and we never tried it before but it was one of the few options available at the Mirage so we're gonna go and see how it is what's it called again Osteria Costa one more time Osteria Costa lots of mirrors in this place <laughs> see look more mirrors. So, the Mirage is home to the Beatles Cirque du Soleil show. Of course, right now it's still closed, but check out how cool this entranceway is. <laughs> so we just had dinner, uh, great meals. We both got the linguine and clams, red wine, and also tiramisu for uh, dessert. And this place is cool. It was the first place I've seen. They they gave us these little baggies to put our masks in. All right, we're gonna get the check now. <laughs> <laughs> So we're in the sports book. I'm guessing it's closed because there's no one here, but uh, it's pretty beautiful and normally it's pretty packed. It's so loud. All right, so we're out from the Mirage. I wanted to show you a couple of shots real quick, but the fire show is going off and it's the first time it's going off since it's reopened since the lockdown. So we're gonna head over there now. Okay guys, we're uh, finishing the night off right now. Oh hi, is this the YouTube gods? Yeah, um, what am I missing in this vlog? Like what, what should I, what can I show to finish off this vlog? Cause I'm trying to, I'm trying to appease the people, you know? And I just don't know what more I can show. I showed the room, dinner, casino, the pool, lots of good stuff. Oh, okay, I can show, okay. I'll call you, talk to you later. Good morning, people. I just dropped off Greta, it's about 9 a.m. I have late checkout at 12. I have a lot of work and editing to do today, but there's a few things I would like to show you still, namely the gym, the spa, and just more of the casino and more of the beauty of what is the Mirage. Um... So, 
also the spa slash salon is open. However, they're only doing in-room massages. So that means that a masseuse comes to your hotel room and gives you the massage there instead of doing it like inside the spa. So I think she also said it was like a 160 for an hour. So the fitness center is actually open as well. It's inside the spa salon. I hate working out at gyms. Um, I definitely don't belong here, so I'm gonna leave, but this is it. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm about to head out of the Mirage, but I wanted to wrap up some thoughts. I am hugely impressed with the Mirage. I really love the room. I love the casino. It's just unbelievably clean. Right now it's very, very low capacity as far as people being here because it just reopened. But man, has this place really impressed me. The pool is incredible despite the cold water. You have the habitat to see animals and dolphins and that was amazing. And you have everything you can need in here for an affordable price really really high class rooms i mean i think it's a four star resort here but from my experience it's on par with all the five stars that i've seen yeah i'm just really happy with everything so i hope you enjoyed the video if you have any questions make sure to leave them in the comments try to be nice in the comments if you really want to leave a rude comment i mean you can go ahead um but try not to do that <laughs> Anyway, if you guys are new here to the channel, I really appreciate you guys for being here. I've been filmmaking for a long time. I'm always excited to see new people discovering my work and stuff like that. If you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe. Throw me a like to support my work uh, if you enjoy the video. That's pretty much it. So, But anyway, thank you guys so much and uh, I look forward to making more videos for you guys. I'll see you guys. Oh, yeah.